Hello once again and today we're going to be taking a look at the 10-in-1 universal USB charger cable for uh, multiple devices. Um, when I say multiple I mean more older older devices not um, the latest um, devices you can get. Um, as you can see um, some, one of these I recognise straight away this one um, is for the old iPods. Um, you can charge your old iPod up. Um, so this is the length of the cable. This is the USB thing itself. So it's not much in the way of cable here. Um, I don't know what that is. Um, I've got a key here. So um, when I say a key, I mean a chart. So it tells you what it's for. This one's for an Sony Ericsson K750. Um, and it will also tell you. I, I will put that um, chart on the end of my video, so you can see what um, it's, um, it can do, what it can charge. If you're interested in purchasing one, um, also got to let you know this is just for charging only. No data transfer can be used with these these cables. Just charging. Um, so we got the old USB. Um, I think that's a Type 1, is it? I can't remember what that one's called now. Uh, I think it's got micro... Is it got micro USB? Yeah. Micro USB there. Um, mini. That's mini USB, sorry. Mini USB, micro USB. Obviously, I ain't going to have Type C. Because um, this, this is quite an old um, cable. And Type C is quite new. So, but it does support a lot of the old ones. You can see... Nokia there, charge up you know Nokia phones. Um it does come from China and it is rather cheap. Um one pound fifty nine. Um I have tr tried out some of the obviously I ain't gonna use all the cables because I'm not I haven't got an old Sony Ericsson anywhere. Um don't I don't know if I've got any old Nokia phones, but I obviously use but the thing is I've got other cables as well. I basically bought this years ago for my iPod, when I owned an iPod, I don't no longer own an iPod now, um, but I've kept the cable, so, yeah, so, we don't really use it anymore, because I've got loads of them USB, mini USB, micro USBs, loads of them knocking around the place, so, really, I have no need for it, really, I say the problem was the iPod, I don't even own an iPod anymore, um, but you never know, they could come in handy, um, yeah, Obviously, it doesn't come with the USB, well, say the plug, but you can plug that into any standard mains plug and it'll work. Obviously, dust comes with the lead itself. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.